yesterday, HubSpot launched their official chat GPT integration, and it's actually a pretty big deal. I want to talk to you about it, share my first thoughts and impressions, and then also try to share where I think things are going to be going that will make all of us tremendously more effective and efficient at our work. So here's the quick news inside of chat GPT. There is the ability to do deep research, and now you can use HubSpot as a source on that research. So what this enables all of us to do is to connect all of our HubSpot data into ChatGPT, and then we can talk to it just like we are talking to other humans and have it spit back the information that it's queried and aggregated. This is massive because a lot of us today are not great at crunching data or understanding how to create the perfect report or the perfect view. And now you don't need to. With this integration, you can just go and ask ChatGPT to aggregate all of the deals by the likelihood to close in your sales pipeline. You can say which deals have been open for 12 months and are currently in this stage and pull that out for me so that I can understand what to do next. So the first thing I want to show you is how to integrate your ChatGPT with HubSpot so you can use this new functionality. It's very simple and they've made a great onboarding experience. All you have to do is when you get into your chat GPT, click on tools, select deep research, add source, and you'll see the connect more button here at the bottom. This will bring you to their list of connectors that are in beta. And here we have HubSpot. So go through this connection setup. It is very fast and allows you to select the portal that you want to connect with. And that's it. Now your HubSpot account is connected with deep research inside of ChatGPT. And you just come in here, select run deep research, and now you have the HubSpot toggle as a source inside of your ChatGPT. Next, I want to show you how to use ChatGPT with HubSpot. So just for context, all of this is dummy data, so I can show you everything. Um, but I'm coming into ChatGPT and asking it to analyze my sales pipeline and tell me the revenue that I've closed on a monthly basis. So it says, great, should I pull this data from your connected HubSpot account? Are there any specific pipelines, deal owners, or time ranges you want to focus on? Should I include all of the closed one deals or are there other stages you'd like to consider? So I answered its questions and it said, great, let me analyze that. So it ran for about six minutes to pull that information and then it gave me my report. So it says, great, monthly closed one revenue in the sales pipeline. For the last 12 or so months, I have no revenue. And then I can see uh, that I have expected revenue that's going to close in October of this year. So it says on October, I had a closed one deal. It looks like I must have postdated that out. And all other months don't have any closed one deals, so resulting in zero revenue. So this is nice, and it gives me my source so I can click in and see what's happening. What's also cool is you can see how it's thinking. So ChatGPT is processing what your query is and it's running down its uh, mental model to basically get that information out, pulling all that information out of HubSpot and querying it for you. And then I asked it to say, great, can you show me the deals that are most likely to close? Um, and then it does that as well. So now it's showing me all of the deals in my sales pipeline by the probabilities, the amount, the stage, and the deal names themselves. And it gives us links to click out into any of those, which is actually really nice because then I can click in and view more information around it. And then it adds it all up. So it can say these deals on the uh, one through five are 90% probability of close because they're in the final stages, um, et cetera, et cetera. So now you can see what it's like to ask ChatGPT to aggregate, synthesize, and pull data out of your HubSpot account. I will be pushing this to its limits in the coming weeks to see how y'all can unlock and maximize your business now using AI with your real business data. Um, and I'll get back to you with uh, my findings. If you do have any questions, leave them in the comments. I'll try to do my best to respond. I am just learning this as much as you are. Um, but it's very exciting for us to be able to finally have access to connecting ChatGPT with HubSpot. And the last thing I want to share with you is where I think that this is all going. So this first step is a massive unlock. Now you can use ChatGPT to pull your HubSpot data and talk to it and work with it. That's massive. 
What's going to happen next is through its integration, you'll be able to add and edit records like deals, contacts, companies, uh, or even custom objects into your HubSpot account just by chatting with ChatGPT. So for example, let's say you have a prospect and you want to go do research on that prospect using ChatGPT. Tell me everything you know about Greg Corellitz. Tell me everything that you know, you know about business XYZ. ChatGPT can go do that research for you. And soon you'll be able to say, great, add this as a company or add this as a contact or deal inside my HubSpot with all of the information you just provided. Or you can take a call recording and put it into ChatGPT and have it synthesize the action items or blockers or tonality and sentiment of the audience that was on the meeting with you and add that to the existing record in your HubSpot. It's going to be amazing. So this uh, new layer of AI plus your software databases is going to make us all way more effective, way more efficient. And now you may never or very rarely need to go into your uh, software user experiences or user interfaces to engage with your HubSpot account or your Notion or ClickUp or any of the companies that are soon going to be integrating with ChatGPT. And this is going to be huge. So now all of us, we no longer need to be data experts. We no longer need to be systems experts to be able to query and analyze what's happening or add information into our CRMs. Um, so it's going to be a crazy world we're going to embark on. My guess is in the next three to six months, all of us have to be adopting this in order to go way faster with our businesses. And so I'm here to try to help you with all of that and learn with you and share with you what I'm finding. So um, let me know again what you'd like to see out of more future videos or more insights around HubSpot and ChatGPT and where AI is going to go for your business. And I'm excited to hear how you're going to use it for your companies and for your own personal use. So thanks for watching. I hope this was helpful and uh, good luck using ChatGPT with HubSpot. See ya.